doing well. How's it going? I'm doing pretty good. How about you? Very good. So I, tell us a little bit about yourself. Where are you from? Okay. And what's your background? Uh, my name is Mosley Wall. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky. Uh, I'm, I'm known as Coach Mo. Uh, Why is that? Uh, because I have a youth organization that I work with young inner city kids, and uh, I train them in, in various different sports and tutor them and mentor them and uh, try to get them going to college and going in the right direction. Okay, that sounds amazing. Is it hard for you to leave to come out here? I was extremely. This is the first summer that I will be away from them, and they do a lot of traveling with the track. We have a track club, mm -hmm. and we do a lot of traveling, and uh, this is the first time I've been, since 2000 I've been away from them. Wow, but they're very supportive, right? I mean, oh, I'm sure. Well, a little bit I could tell them. I, you know, they they know that I'm going out and to do something special, so they they support me just like I support them. Great. Now, because you do you have a background in athletics, yes, I do. And obviously, here the situation is extremely exercise focused. How do you think that's going to help you? Has it prepared you at all for the rigors of this? Uh. I think being an athlete has prepared me for it because, of course, you know, to, to go and play college ball, both football and basketball, you had to be uh, um, uh, trained hard. And, and, and this kind of reminds me of uh, what we used to call a hell week. Right. You know, the two a days. And you just, you just so wore out. It's good that you can make it the next day, and then you go back. Uh, but back then, what they would do with athletes, they would feed them because they wanted to keep the big guys big and the little guys at that, that, that right. weight. Uh, the difference here is that you know we're not counting calories and not eating as much, and uh, uh, it's more focused. But my my uh, background in sports, I think, will prepare me. The difference is I've, I've got injuries now. I'm totally disabled. Uh, I am uh, the oldest person here. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm the oldest person here. Well, we know what happens, right? Yeah, you watch last yes, season. Yes, I did. And that's my oh. inspiration too. That's right. So, I mean, I even told myself, well, I may go home first, but guess what? I'll be back. That's right. So, I, I, and I, you learn so much so fast. Uh, I'm, I'm, I already got my mind set on what it is I have to do when I get home. So, even a short time here, you think it's beneficial? Oh, it's amazing. My mind, the whole total mindset has changed in one week. Great. See, I think that's perfect. And I think that's really good for people at home to know because there are so many people at home that watch this and think, oh, if I could just come to the ranch, if I could just come to the ranch, everything would change. But, you know, Everyone here is going to be proof that short time, long time, that it is possible as long as they get that mindset, right? Oh, excuse me. Yes, yes. Uh, being here is amazing. I'm, I'm still in awe about being here. Uh, but like I said, my mind has been clicking to the point where you know it is a game, and I could get rolled off. And once I did that, I was okay. What am I going to do when I get home? I started making preparations to to, to be at home. Great. If it happens. And and everybody needs to know that there's so many people have lost so many weight so much weight after was it three million pounds they've lost after that? Some astronomical number. Yeah. I mean it can be done. Uh, the guy the guy he uh, made the second week, he was kicked off, he came back and won a hundred thousand dollars. Exactly. Was it, how many how many pounds did he lose? A hundred and oh. was a hundred <laughs> I mean that's amazing because he 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 was sixty four years old, older than I am. Uh, I don't even know if he had an athletic background or not. But I he, don't think so. I don't think Jerry did. But when you saw him, his arms were just cut yeah. and ripped. He really went home and worked on, on, on being better. And that's amazing to see. And all Americans do realize, you look at that, man, you can do it at home. But, yeah. you, but it's done here first. Right. You so you're ready and you're going to represent for kind of our older people and show them that here yeah. or there they can do it. Doesn't matter. Great. Well, thanks, Mo. Okay. All right. Good job.